<sighs> Questions. <laughs> Great. <laughs> so, tell us about the video. Well, um, oh, you probably notice I'm a little bit hoarse. <laughs> I've been terribly busy on the hustings. All right, how's that been going? I think really marvellously. I mean, you, you really get the sense people are desperate for change. Which is, and I know that's where you're here, uh, what, my, what my song's about. Great Britain is the best. It, it, it's an ironic look, and I hope amusing look, at, at 12 years in Britain under the disaster that is the new Labour experiment. The, the waste, the corruption, the incompetence. And why, why specifically the music format? Why a song? Why a video? You know what? I really felt it was time to reach out to the young people. The people who might be disillusioned by politics, talk to them in the universal language of popular song. <laughs> <laughs> right, and, and how's that going? Well, I mean, it's not for me to say. Uh, <laughs> my, my colleagues do have a new nickname for me, MP3, uh. which, as I'm sure you know, is, is the format that the, that the young people use to, to get their music out there to the, to the world via the internet or, 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 or where, wherever else. That, that's right, that's right. And can I ask, uh, how does your uh, trademark summer suit go down with that, uh, the young crowd? Again, not for me to say, but I, I was doing some research into, into, into popular music, popular music bands and groups, and I found they often wore a sort of costume, a sort of outfit, so they'd be, they'd be recognised. I call it my, my suit of change. <laughs> now, last summer your, your comments caused some controversy in the party and in the media. How, how have things been since then? Oh, I don't know whether I'd go so far as to say uh, controversy. I mean, my, needless to say, my words were taken completely out of context. But they, they were quite explicit and uh, David Cameron himself expressed some concern at the direction they showed. Oh, did he? I mean, I like to think of myself as, as right in, in Dave's inner circle, in, in, in what I call the vanguard of new compassionate conservatism. We believe that just because you care about business, it doesn't mean you don't care about important social issues, like, like getting the young people off the dole and back but, into but, work. But like, is, like... is that true? Are you part of David Cameron's inner set? In his comments last year, he said your comments showed ignorance and intolerance. He said you were using rhetoric bordering on the BNP. Dave's a friend. Dave's a friend. I mean, in fact, just last week, Dave and I were enjoying a, a pint of beer together. <laughs>